I have an edit with Oasis Fashions. The shoulder, knit jumper, those autumn winter outfits to life. So next, of course, I had to have some pink in the edit. A structured coat that could be styled lots of different ways. Just added a bit. So these come in multiple different colours. Hi, please. Welcome back to a new video. How are you guys doing? I'm sure you've all guessed from the title. This is a very exciting video because I have an edit with Oasis Fashion. So it means basically like I've created a dreamy roundup of autumn winter pieces that I love that I love styling and it's all for like new season and it's all pieces that I've kind of collectively put together because I just felt like they're capsule core pieces that not only can you wear for all of autumn and winter and even then moving if you're in the UK into like spring because I feel like we still have those cold days but mainly that you can style the pieces so many different ways and together and separately and I've just been so excited to film this and finally share it. I'm going to leave some pictures on the screen here of just what the outfits are from just like picture form so you guys can see because me and Jay and like some friends last week over the last couple of weeks have just been kind of creating the content so that I can show you guys how excited I am to wear them on repeat and style them over the next couple of months as well so yeah without further ado let's get straight into the video I also just quickly want to say thank you for being here thank you for supporting me thank you for honestly making like things like this make like possible I was gonna say amazing but possible and being able to like collaborate with brands that I really really do love and just with being able to kind of share my love for styling with you all because I love styling and I love being able to share things like this so thank you thank you thank you thank you let's jump in so in the edit I really wanted to basically include like a roundup of those capsule pieces and just kind of do pieces that you guys could gravitate towards and style loads of different ways of like capsule jeans and little white tees and just have like multiple use out of everything that's included in this so the pieces I'm going to share are pieces that I am gonna be wearing on repeat, so you guys will see lots of it anyway and lots of ways to wear, but if there's anything in particular you're like, can you style that different ways, then do just comment down below. Like, I'm kind of thinking maybe the fake liver trousers in this edit need like a few ways to wear for you guys because they are a fave. But first off, this beautiful oat colored off the shoulder knit jumper. So this comes in a few different colorways, but I went for this one because I feel like it just goes so perfectly with neutrals. Also more of those like browns and orangey tones, which I really, really love wearing in the autumn winter months just to like add a little bit of color. But this for me is like a very classic kind of chic outfit that I'm very excited to kind of wear to like casual meetings and also just out and about for dinners and brunches and I just feel like this is the softest cuddliest but also quite like glam and chic off the shoulder knit that adds just a bit more something because I feel like when it's winter you can't really wear outfits that like you're like oh I want to wear this top but then it's too cold to show it off whereas things like this you kind of still have that element of like this is a nice top and jean combo but it's a knit jumper so you're warm at the same time. So of course I had to have a hound's tooth or dog's tooth whatever you want to call it kind of coat and I just love it I love the premium quality of this I love the slight detailed structure to it that's kind of instantly what made me fall in love with this coat is that I just love structure and coats I feel like it makes them very premium it makes it look very like chic and tailored and I just love the detailing of this I also love that coats like this can just bring any of those autumn winter outfits to life and as you guys can see there's really nice texture to it it's really really soft it's very very thick so right now currently today it's like 25 degrees still but i think next week it's starting to get more autumnal by the time i'm this is going live so i feel like this is gonna be perfect for me to wear on the colder days but at the moment it is i am sweating so if i do look very shiny that is why but i just love it i feel like it elevates any of the outfits it goes really nicely with like oak colors and browns because of the kind of detailing you've got in it and then that kind of darker tone to it goes really nicely with black accessories as well so i just feel like there's multiple ways you can style this this is just one of like the classic ways that i was planning on styling it like this because I love it with the oat knit and I just feel like this would be a really cool kind of shopping day, brunch, casual meetings or I guess quite dressed up meetings depending on where you're working and what meetings you have but I just love outfits like this and you could also just dress down this outfit with just flat trainers as well and then just have this to elevate 
all the looks. So next, of course, I had to have some pink in the edit because it wouldn't be a me kind of edit without a little bit of pop of colour. So I went for this beautiful jumper dress and it is so soft. Again, the quality is like really thick and premium. It's got a really nice stretch to it, but I also loved the shape of the sleeves. I like that you can kind of mix and match how you're tying the waist as well. You can also, if you wanted, take the belt off and you can't see the belt loops that easily if you wanted it very, very loose as well. It depends how you like to style your jumper dresses. But I just thought this was really lovely in adding some colour and then when it gets a little bit colder I could do tights with high knee boots and then like a black long coat instead as well just to kind of add another layer to it but I had to have some high knee boots in the edit because I love them and I feel like autumn is the perfect time to like have your legs out a little bit but then have a high knee boot so that it's not too chilly if it's chilly but also it's very transitional lovely kind of capsule piece to have so these are very very beautiful very chunky and guys I've trialed and tested them I wore them last week with like fake leather shorts little tailored mini skirts they are so so comfortable they also come in like a navy and then also like a taupe color so they're in the edit as well if you guys want to go for like a color that works lots of different ways in your wardrobe but I just love the style of them I like how chunky the heel is I like the fact that I know that I'm gonna be able to like wear them into London and wear them all day like shopping and going around and going for brunches or meetings for work that I have in London and I know I'm going to be comfy especially when you're like on and off the underground and like traveling all over the place I feel like you need comfy boots in autumn and winter so these have got us covered. Talking of tailored coats I wanted to add one into the edit that was also just a black classic tailored structured coat that could be styled lots of different ways as it is as well so this one I went for in the edit because I loved the gold accent details I like the fact that you've got the belt so you can really kind of mix up how you're wearing it but then also just have it as just like a classic chuck on coat for like girls nights evenings out birthday occasions dinners and just every day like this with a white tee and blue jeans is just perfect black coat and like casual capsule pieces for autumn and winter days and I just love the feel of it I love the structure of it it's got the pockets as well and then the really subtle kind of tailoring to it which I just thought was so premium and yeah just so stunning and so yeah I wish you guys could feel through the screen in this video I wish that was like a feature because the quality of it if I come up close is just so soft and really really thick and beautiful as well next outfit I went for this really beautiful embroidered jumper in the edit because I wanted something that was like quite, quite classic but also just added a bit more something like I feel like it's so easy to get those comfy sweatshirts for autumn and winter and it just be a little bit boring with a look so I wanted to add something in there that had more of that detailing too and it's like really super snuggly soft underneath like can you see the fluff like it's so soft on and I just thought the flowers just added more detail made it a little bit more like I don't know just cute and I like the orange flowers on this especially because I like those oranges and like brown tones for styling and I feel like then it makes it really easy to style with those accessories and pieces to elevate the look. A transitional outfit for moving into autumn and winter and then potentially at some point when it gets colder doing like tights or spot tights and then adding on the black slouch coat as well if I needed it on the colder days. Next outfit I actually think might be a fave of mine from the edit. I again like I said at the start like really love texture and prints in autumn and winter just to kind of bring the outfits to life a little bit more and I just love how soft this is I love the detailing to it and I just love the tones to it like this OT kind of like brown color if I show you guys up close it's just so so stunning and I feel like it really complements jewelry I don't really know why I just love how the gold and the knit stand out together and then these beautiful beautiful kick fair jeans so these come in multiple different colors they're a very 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 soft fabric and that, like have a very nice stretch to them but they still feel very like high quality so I'll show you guys up close in a second of those but you've got the belt loops they fit true to size they're like a mid to high I'd say like they fit just where like my hips are like on top of my hips and I am wearing the three inch heels boots at the moment and they fit perfectly I'm five foot three and I feel like if I wear trainers which I have done I wore my specials last week with these I just what I did is I just slightly rolled up like that and then some days I really really at the moment love that kind of look with trainers not with 
the heels but I love a very very rolled cuff hem on jeans so I feel like these are the perfect jeans to kind of do that with if you're five foot four and below but the stretch of these is just beautiful like they have a very very soft stretch to them so basically just makes them very very comfortable on and very very easy to like fit your bum and your thighs and your waist because I swear with jeans it is so hard to find jeans that fit your waist and then everywhere else because I feel like they're made for like waist sizes or like a certain body type in certain brands and these just fit very very lovely because they're comfy on and you can like get them on and all that kind of stuff so I love these and they come in lots of different colours as well in case you guys are looking to invest in some more jeans. So next I added into the edit this very very beautiful striped roll neck jumper. I feel like this is again a capsule classic and I just loved the beautiful detailing of this like I loved the sleeves you've got this kind of like double layer sleeve and I liked the different textures of the stripes within it I feel like it's a little bit different than just like your average stripe jumper that has it all the same all over so I absolutely love this and then I went for a straight leg blue authentic jean in the edit because I think this is just all seasons all year round capsule classic and I love the color of these I feel like having a color like this goes really really nicely with those like autumn browns but then in spring looks so nice with like pastels because they really kind of balance each other out so I thought these would be perfect they're very very soft again you've got the belt loops and they just feel very premium and beautiful on and again I just loved the fact that they just fit like a dream like they fit true to size they have that very authentic feel but very soft stretch and and I just thought they were gorgeous so with the boots again from the edit which I just feel like it's quite nice to have a little bit of a height to any outfit especially if you're five foot four and under I absolutely love having a little heel on especially when they're comfy boots and this is like a very chic kind of autumn outfit that could easily be styled with just flat trainers for like more casual days out and then you could also style with a black slouch coat as well so I just thought this was a lovely one for transitioning into the colder days so I just wanted to show you the last piece, but with the coat first, just so you guys can see how I would kind of layer over in the autumn winter days with a coat with this outfit. And then when it gets a little bit colder, again, with the high knee boots putting on tights, but again, just showing you another way with the dog's tooth coat, how you can literally take an all neutral outfit, whatever you've got and just bring it to life and make it a little bit more fun. Like if there's one thing in this edit that you're like, I'm unsure which one to go for, Although there's loads I could, I'm being biased, but there's loads that I'd be like, this one and this one. Obviously make sure it's something that you would style multiple different ways, but a dog's tooth, hands tooth coat for me, throughout any of the seasons, especially being in the UK, is something I always gravitate towards and wear on repeat. I just always feel like I struggle in autumn and winter usually without something like this to kind of bring those looks to life, to have something that I'm like, I feel like this is quite cool and fun. And again, just elevates any of those outfits. I mean, there's a lot in here that is capsule pieces. So I'm finding it quite hard to be like, get this one, get this one. But if there are pieces that you guys want to see, honestly, multiple ways of styling, then do let me know. And I will do as many outfits as I can of like fake leather trousers or jumper dresses or high knee boots whatever it is, comment down below and I'll get around to doing that. But I just thought the coat with this just really elevated the look for more of those like wintry cold days. And then on the days like today, where I actually do think I could wear this because it is a little bit breezy. I just went out and it's like a fresh sunny day that I feel like this one could actually be really nice for today out and about because I have a shopping day with my cousin and then I'm going for brunch, well, brunchy kind of dinner. <laughs> I feel like I shouldn't say brunch, it's more lunch dinner with her and my family. So I feel like this would be a nice little option for that. But then also for like city days out, this is a nice option, but it's this beautiful jumper dress that's the same as the oat kind of crop jumper, but in the dress version. And I just love, again, the feel of this. I like how beautiful the off the shoulder is it just feels gorgeous on and I have styled it with a belt however in the photos which I'll leave here I actually styled with a black shoelace tie belt because I have a few of those for like some of my jeans from different brands and I feel like it's just an easy way of like not having a chunky accessory if you don't really feel like it however I do love elevating my looks with accessories so I feel like like this is a really nice way to kind of tie in with the jewelry that you love by styling with a belt with this too and then without anything on me personally I'm a little bit too short for the jumper dress but it does look like very cool like if I did a fake leather jacket with this I feel like that would look really cool but yeah I'm definitely a belt kind of gal so I went for the belt with that one but 
yeah which piece is your favorite guys let me know let me know what you think of the edit i will leave everything linked down below and like all size references as well although majority of i think pretty much everything in here is a size six or a size small so i will leave references to that down below too just in case but yeah that is the edit i have been honestly desperate to share with you guys i would love to know what you think i would yeah just let me know and I am just yeah very very grateful that I was able to collaborate with them on like creating something with pieces that I love and styling them like I literally had so much fun shooting it out and about with Jay and Brighton like we were like we were both like bouncing back and forth to each other being like this is just mad like I love like I just feel so passionate about styling and I can't believe I get to do that so I'm not gonna cry <laughs> because <laughs> just don't need to cry I'm really emotional at the moment but I yeah can't thank you guys enough for being here can't thank you enough for supporting me in this space and just always like commenting about styling stuff because it really is a passion of mine and I really hope that in some small way like it gives inspiration for pieces in your own wardrobe gives inspiration for pieces that you might be looking to invest in or just even like recreating things that you have in your own wardrobe at home as well so yeah thank you for being here thank you for supporting me and i will see you guys in the next video lots of love Mwah. bye